Hello, people. Have you ever wondered that you can bring a real person into the 3D world within few minutes of time? Here we go. We have the Pop2 3D scanner, which you can scan anything in high resolution. As you can see, we have set up our Revelpoint 3D scanner and the 3D turntable that we have received with the scanner. On top of that, we have put our Mountain Dog statue. The 3D scanner and turntable are both connected with an USB cable to the PC, so no batteries are needed for them. In the software itself, which is RevoScan, you can check and adjust the distance between the turntable and the scanner. When you are ready to start scanning, click on New Scan and adjust the settings on how you need them. And then you can start scanning. For more information on the settings, you can go to the RevelPoint website, where you can find tutorials. Let it scan until it captured enough information. And when it's done scanning, you can have the RevoScan software fill up the holes and get the mesh ready to export to other softwares. In this video, we will show you how you can bring a real person into the 3D world within few minutes of time. Let's get started. Now we are trying to scan the face, so we will have to start from the front view and slowly move on to the left and right profile so we can capture all of the details of the face. You can also capture the entire head if you want to capture the entire head. But right now, we are just trying to capture the face. Once the scanning process is done, you will have the automatic cleanup tool for you in the software. They have provided the software for you for free. You can use that and clean that up and generate the head. Right now, I'm in the Unreal Engine. I'm trying to create the MetaHuman using this scanned head. Once you have the scan, it's pretty easy to generate the MetaHuman character. You can use that for the games and movies and cinematic. With this scanner, you can just generate any character of the real person and bring that person into the 3D world. It's pretty easy to do and it will be done within a few minutes of time. You don't have to spend eternity to do that. From now onwards, the process is pretty simple. After arranging the tracks for the eye sockets, eyebrows and smile lines and you have the lip lines there once you arrange all of those tracks all you need to do is just click on the meta human identity solver then click on the mesh to meta human once you click on it all you need to do is just go to the meta human creator and launch it and log in with your details you will see your character right there
once you finish all the work inside of the Unreal Engine 5, just start your MetaHuman Creator and log in with your details of Epic. Then you can see your character in front of your screen. Now you can change the skin of the character. You can also change the eyes colors and stuff like that. It's pretty simple stuff. You can add the eyebrows. You can add the hair. And you can change the body proportions. You can add the clothes. And that's done. That's how you create the characters using these scanned faces. Thank you for watching.